You're listening to the best local sports show. Boots, Bats and Balls on Six Towns Radio. Chills Bar, Baisley. Sponsors of Port Vale content on Six Towns Radio. Ben Williamson. Two home games in the last seven days. Let's first of all talk about Saturday. Uh, two nil up against York. What happened? Yeah, obviously it's very disappointing when you're two nil up. It's always a bit dodgy. If they get one goal, you sort of maybe panic. But it wasn't to be at the end of the day. But the main thing was we didn't lose and we still got a point out of the game. So I'll take the yeah. positives. Well. You've got to take the positives. But it was just um, not Vale's month really. You know, so many draws. But you know, again, they are points. They're not like losses. Uh, so it must have been frustrating taking that into Tuesday night's match, which of course went perfect. Yeah, obviously we could have. Could have been the same on Saturday last week, um, but this time we got three goals in the first half, and we thought we'd try and get an early goal in the second half, and it worked out well for us, and we got the four, three points. Yeah, it's good for you as well, because like getting another goal into it onto your score sheet. Yeah, obviously it wasn't the best goal I've ever scored, but <laughs> you'll take them happily, and uh, yeah, it was nice to be on the score sheet. Yeah, have you set yourself a target for the season? Uh, initially, it was to. Uh, claim a starting place, so I've mm-hmm. got that on Tuesday, and hopefully I did enough to stay in the team now, and uh, obviously try and score goals, and hopefully stay in the team for Saturday. Yeah, great uh, game again for Tom Pope, another hat trick. Has he been given some like boots from an ancestor who used to bang goals? <laughs> I think he's been given something on his head. He just can't score, stop scoring with his head, mm-hmm. can he? Um, yeah, he's obviously had a great season so far, and. Fair play to the wingers, they've served him well and he's, he's thrived on it and obviously 20 goals speaks for itself. Feel good factor as well with the takeover going through, there was the Sprosen statue going up at the weekend, you know, so um, it's you know looking good, there's some light shining over Vale Park at the moment, isn't there? Yeah, there's been a light at the end of the tunnel, I guess, obviously it's been a long nine months now and it's been dragging on and obviously we thought we were going to be taken over in the summer, but obviously that didn't work out, but it's just nice to finally have a cap on it and obviously pushing the right direction now. Yeah, and your contracts are now sorted, you've got a proper contract finally. Yeah, yeah proper contract, uh, only until the end of the season for me, so mm-hmm. just got to work hard and see what happens. Well, that could be good, you know, with the new owners coming in, obviously Mickey might have a few more quid to spend to bolster the squad because it is a long season, yeah, only a small got, squad at the moment. We have got quite a small, small squad at mm-hmm. the moment, obviously only 18 uh, we're involved on. And every week, and we've been struggling to get 18 at times, so hopefully we'll bring in new faces and go to the squad. Yeah, and I think you've already done quite a lot yourself coming off the bench and scoring. It's always difficult, you know what I mean? I know you are a fresh pair of legs, but you know, you've only got a few minutes to score when you come on, and uh, you've done that and you've scored from starting as well, haven't you? Yeah, it's obviously really hard when you come off the bench and um, you just try, and if you do get a chance, you've obviously tr- got to try and take it, and that's what I've tried to do, and obviously I've been started the last game, so hopefully that can continue. Mm-hmm. Away, all shot Saturday. Yeah, what are your thoughts getting into that game? Uh, yeah, they had a big win during the week, and um, they'll be fighting for every point they can get as they're quite near the bottom at the moment. So it'll be a tough game. Every game's a tough game in this league, and that's been said before, but it is actually true. And hopefully, we can go there and put on a performance. We've travelled quite well uh, this season and scored a lot of goals away from home, so hopefully that can continue. Yeah, and then it's the cup games after that: Johnson's Pay and FA Cup. Um, you must be excited about those games as well. Yeah, two massive games. Obviously, we travel to Sheffield. That'll be a great occasion. Uh, all the lads will be buzzing for that, and then uh, obviously the JPT as well. So, got two big games coming up, but then it'll be a sticky Christmas period with loads of league games. So, it's a big month coming up, really. Yeah, brilliant. Thanks, that. Cheers, bye. We love music. You are locked into Six Towns Radio.